Hey guys, welcome back. Hey, this is going to be uh, the last vi uh, weekend of the South Dakota season, uh, which was January 31st, and I took, that was a Monday, and I took it off work to hunt. Uh, it was the first time I'd done that all season, and so I got to la hunt the last three days. Um, didn't hunt real hard, we didn't have any snow on the ground, but I hunted enough to get two each day. Um, really wrapped up our, our season great. As some of you know, I am plagued by technical difficulties with my camera, whether it be dead batteries or whatever, you know, pushing the wrong button, turning it off when I mean to turn it on, stuff like that. Uh, sometimes I just don't want to wear it because, you know, quite frankly, in my stocking cap with the head strap, it's not terribly comfortable. I got more used to it as the season progressed this year and uh, really worked out pretty good but sometimes I just don't want to wear it don't want to deal with it um, so I didn't get all the footage from the weekend but I got some of it including some pretty decent ones uh, this first one was Saturday um, our first bird of the day and we we'd hunted uh, basically it wasn't really hunting as much as walking clear around this one uh, it's actually one of the few game production areas I hunt in eastern South Dakota uh, but we hunted clear around uh, the whole thing to get to this one little peninsula way, way in the back and happened to have a bird in it. Anyway, here it is. It, everything worked out great. We had sun. Uh, we had a good shot. We had a good retrieve. It was just one of those that really, for me, was a good one. Hey, Spitch! Good boy, good boy, come, 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 come! Fetch! Fetch, 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 fetch! Good boy! Good boy, stay, sit, sit, sit! Good boy! That was fun. He's getting hot like that. Had to do a little running. Hung him good. Late, late season, South Dakota. 
public land rooster. Closed nose. Salam, Mr. Rooster. Nice. That makes, there's the truck. We came all the way along there, all the way around the back there, all the way out here just to get to this little peninsula. Come here. ones that you really earn feel pretty good. Easy ones are nice once in a while. That guy's a valuable rooster. Both held up our end of the bargain, didn't we, Ace? Good deal.
this next one is the first bird on Monday. Uh, it was a little ditch, and you'll notice right at the very beginning of it, uh, there's a hawk that flies out of the trees in the, by the ditch. Um, when I was driving up to this spot, I saw two hawks sitting in this tr one dead tree, and that's a little uncommon. Usually, if I see a hawk, there's one, not two. Anyway, one of them flew out of the tree as I was still driving. The other one waited until we were actually out of the car, ready to walk the ditch, and then he took off. Anyway, we hunted the ditch and got a pheasant and it was really buried in there. He did not want to fly. And afterwards, I kind of put two and two, two, and two together, I think, maybe. Uh, I suspect that those hawks knew that that rooster was there, and I suspect that the rooster knew that those hawks were there, and he wasn't going to move until either those hawks left or a Springer Spaniel stuck his nose up his tail. So check this one out. Good boy, come! Fetch, good boy! Come, fetch, good boy! Fetch! Good boy, good boy! Good boy! Sit! Good boy! Drop, good boy! buried, wasn't he, Ace? And you had to actually dig him out of there. That's why I have you. One, last day of the season, January 31st, 2022. It's one. Eastern South Dakota, little ditch.
This last one is the last bird of the season. Uh, it's a WPA, and again, we I wanted to hit a couple of spots way in the back because uh, I knew that pheasants had been using them. I'd hunted it once before in the year, and had seen a lot of pheasants. Didn't get any, but they had been there uh, in large numbers. Anyway, I did not get lucky where I hoped to, and we hunted around the whole thing, and we're basically on our way out. Uh, try, just trying to get back to the truck uh, through an area that we had somewhat hunted already um, you know maybe 45 minutes to an hour previously and uh, Ace ran into some frag mites and flushed one and it ended up being a case where I, I tickled him twice he got behind some hot some real tall stuff and I literally did not know whether he had ever touch the ground. I had no idea. I thought I'd give it a try. Uh, I was really m mad at myself because I didn't follow Ace as, as far as I should have. Had I done that, it would have been a much better shot as it was. It was a 45-yard oh, first shot and a 55-yard second shot, something like that. And number five bismuth just falls flat out there. Um, anyway, Ace was uh, true to form. He turned my last bird of the year from a major disappointment into uh, really being happy and a great way to wrap up our season. So here it is. Check it out. Thanks for joining us. Damn it, Ace, I'm sorry. I have no idea where it went, huh, Ace? If it went down at all. I mean, kind of that way, ish. We'll try it a little bit. I don't know where he went down. He did. Maybe I'll find him. Hey! Get in here! Come on!
No way! Ace! Fetch! Good boy! Woohoo! Good boy! Fetch! Come, come, come! Good boy! Woo! Good boy! I thought he got hit a little bit harder than it looked like. Good boy! Little bit of pane, bro. Dead. So long, Mr. Closed Nose. Boy, he didn't go near as far as I would have suspected. Woo! <laughs> Feel a little bit dumb getting that excited about it. That was fun. <laughs> January 31st. I trusted my dog, but I didn't. I mean, he raced in there with a purpose. And all it would have taken to make that a lot better opportunity was if I had gone another 10, 15 yards. As it was, it was a long shot. I think I hit him twice. We'll see what the video shows. Didn't really have a line on him, but kind of knew a general direction. Wow. Good boy, Ace. You get that one. You get that one. I didn't help much. Okay. Ace, come! That's pretty neat. We are, we have hunted, we, the truck is, there, there's the truck. We came out this way over here, way up into that corner. No Pane. Our best spot for Pane is over there. Nothing. All along that far fence, then to the south, saw a couple of birds up there that didn't cooperate at all. And we're coming back here just to basically get out of here. That's the season. Oh, ended on a pretty good note. Got two. One really fabulous flush. Well, the other one was a good flush too, but a better recovery.
got cows, we got dog pooping, sunset, two roosters in the truck. Pretty good year. I gotta wait till October. Hey cows. Oh Ace, your friend cows are coming to say hi. Look Ace. Hey! Look who's coming to say hi. brown white dog. Look, they're coming over to see you. Yeah, they're coming to see Acey Wacy. Oh, here's one that really is friendly. Boy, Ace, aren't they friendly little cows? Yeah. Yeah, I think they think you have a snack for them. Yeah. Aren't they cute? Okay, we better go. Good boy, come on. Say bye to the cows. Bye, cowies. Bye, cows. Okay, stay here. Come on. 